So I woke up to news this morning that a man tried to attack Dave Chappelle on stage and his and Dave Chappelle security did a great job of removing the man from stage. This is probably a live picture of what happened to that man after he ran up on Dave Chappelle on stage. They say Dave Chappelle even tussled with the man a little bit. I'm, I'm, I'm a very strong advocate for not being malicious to fans and not being cutting and rude to fans and stuff like that. But at the same time, listen, to anybody that enjoys comedy, anybody that enjoys live events, let, let me warn y'all. Y'all can't just run up on people. It was unfortunate what happened to Chris Rock, but Chris Rock is one in a zillion, okay? Chris Rock is one in a millennia. Chris Rock is one in a star. There's a billion zillion stars in the sky that we can't count. Y'all gonna get y'all ass beat to sleep, okay? And it ain't gonna even take Dave Chappelle security, who's probably lethal weapon. Dave Chappelle probably had a bunch of Danny Glovers and Mel Gibsons from Lethal Weapon Part 1 around him. That man probably is guarded by the same people that was guarding Takashi as soon as he got out of prison. Dave Chappelle is messing with people that got a bag, they got a heavy foot, they got heavy hands, I guarantee you. Dave Chappelle security probably bathe in Timberland boots with steel toes, don't, but the average person, like, for me, for my example, I'm not a tough guy, but if you run up on me on stage, it ain't, it ain't gonna be no, like, mic dropping. Get this guy, listen, I'm going all out by mine, I'm talking about, like, Tupac hit him up, I'm going I'm gonna I'm gonna try to end stuff that you ain't never knew began. Like you gonna be like Josh, that vein don't come out of there. Could you put that back with no? I cannot. Okay, before y'all go to these events and run up on people, just think about your kids. And if you don't got kids, think about your dogs and cats at home. If you don't got dogs and cats at home, think about the roaches in your kitchen. Just think about stuff before you go run up on random people because random people gonna beat y'all ass and some of y'all ain't gonna survive. Um, I don't support all the stuff the baby do because the baby be wider sometimes, but a lot of people going to start defending themselves like the baby and then you're going to be sleeping and, and then people going to have to start having, you know what I'm saying, fundraisers to bury your stupid ass in the casket <clears throat> because you went to an event where a person was performing and you were trying to make a point. If you like that person or you're trying to make a stance or you're trying to get the attention, but sometimes your ass gonna open that book bag and get what you're looking for. Don't go, don't go hunting. Okay. Don't go goodwill hunting because sometimes you're going to find what you're looking for. Like every, every bag, nice as blue. Everything is a bad necessity. We ain't going to float down the river with you sitting on my stomach. I'm telling you right now, Sometimes that bear gonna let, like that tree gonna fall on barking up the wrong tree is gonna fall on your ass and you gonna be gonna be looking like this dude and stumped the yard. Remember when Chris Brown did a headstand and got shot? That's gonna be you without no head. That that shot gonna make your ass do the same headstand that Chris Brown was doing. I'm just telling you, don't. And then that was yeah, that was stumped the yard. So yeah, don't get your yard stumped. Like, good job, Dave Chappelle security team. Good job.